So this is everything that we need to do for this tarp. Bring it down here. Yep. Where you're flush down here at this end, yep. where you can tie it. Okay. Bring it down to the door. There's the middle. The door is going to get eyelets every foot all the way around. You roll this up, and they can sew uh, two pieces of strap about an inch wide yep. onto here with snaps, like your cover on your yep. boat's got. Yep. You roll it up, and you snap the cover, and the, the snap around it, on, snap, snap, and then your door is rolled up right here. Nice. And then you just come and go. And if you want to close your door, you unsnap it, throw it right. down, tie it off. And then we're going to put an eyelet every foot. An eyelet every foot. Yep, all the way around. Yep. And this needs cut off. You'll have to mark the, the inside. Well, they got a seam right there. It'd be nice to leave that seam. It would. I would probably leave that seam because that's yep. going to be nice and tight there. But if, if you could get... Originally, you'd want to stop it here. Yep. Because you want to go around with your rope and tie it. And who do you suggest we probably have? Miller's this? Custom Canvas on okay. the other side of Milford. A bunch of Amish. They got oh, okay. Amish women. You go into this place, it's just big tables laid out. Okay. Uh, I never even heard of it till this summer. Kevin Pells, he had this guy up doing a boat lift for it in Shannon Hills. So we'll just show him this video and say, do it. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure they can figure this out. Yeah. You know, like. Every three foot they put eyelets. Well, you want one at every foot. Yep. Because you want to lace this. The more rope and the more coils you get, the stronger it's going to stay. Yep. And then we just do the, the rope all the way. Yeah, right now it looks yeah. like hillbilly because we... But that's okay. The rope. Yeah. A funky way to do it. But this shouldn't go anywhere. I mean, nope. for now it's covered. Yeah, for sure.